let's see now integrated rate equation for first order reaction consider a first order reaction that is reactant r use product p since it is first order reaction you can write rate law as rate equal to minus dr by dt equal to k into concentration of r to the power r to the power 1 you know why negative negative is because rate with respect to reactant will be always with negative sign now we have to integrate this equation so in order to make uh, now separate the variable see uh, here is dr so take r this side and here is constant you can take this dt this side so dr by r equal to take this minus the also this side minus k dt now integrate on both side integrating on both side integration of 1 by r is ln r integration of 1 by r is logarithm of r it is similar as integration of 1 by x into dx please if you don't know integration please ask your teacher 1 by integration of 1 by x is log x see here also integration of 1 by r with respect to dr is log r see here ln indicates logarithm of base e that, that is ln r integration of minus k dt integration of constant into dt is minus kt since it is uh, indefinite integral we have to add constant integration integral constant that is i i have added integral constant as i so where i is constant of integration call this equation as 1 now in this equation you have to find value of i how you find for that apply boundary condition boundary condition means at the beginning of the reaction that is at uh, at the beginning of the reaction time will be zero no at the time t equal to zero and at the beginning of the reaction concentration of the reactant r will be r naught that is initial concentration of the reactant now substitute this uh, t equal to zero and r equal to r naught in the equation one see this is your equation one substitute here r equal to r naught and uh, t equal to zero see i have substituted log of r equal to r naught and t equal to zero so ln r naught equal to minus k into zero plus i now what do you get ln r naught equal to i this is i equal to ln r naught now again substitute this value of i in this equation number one you are finding value of i now you got the value of i now substitute that value of i in the equation one so what you get ln r minus kt and value of i is ln r naught now we have to find value of k so try to extract the value of k so for that take this kt this side and ln r this side so kt equal to ln r r naught minus ln r so k equal to what happens now see in this log ln logarithm log r naught minus log r is log r naught by r 
it is similar as log m minus log n you know in mathematics that is log m minus log n is log m by n which is also similar log r naught minus log r is log r naught by r that equal to kt now you can also write uh, this as r equal to r naught into e to the power minus kt i will explain it later now concentrate on this one only now try to extract uh, we are finding the value of k see try to extract the value of k now k equal to take this t this side 1 by t ln r naught by r see this is uh, in lo logarithm of base e logarithm of base e if you want to convert it into logarithm of base 10 you have to multiply this equation by 2.303 so converting base e to 10 you are, you are multiplying 2.303 so k equal to 2.303 by t into log of r naught by r so this is the integrated rate equation for first order reaction please remember this uh, integrated rate equation this is a uh, very common and most problems are in this uh, equation only please remember this one k equal to 2.303 divided by time into log of r naught by r